Good morning. It's Thursday the 8th. We are leaving Trippy Shelter. Well, we're about to. It's 6.15 a.m. We get to go to town today. We're very excited. Six days with no shower or, or good. Or salad. Or salad. That's the more important thing. Or fruit. Or any of the good stuff. So we've got about 10 miles to hike and we will be there. A little bird up there. She stayed in the shelter with us last night. We've been hiking for 2.18 miles. It is so humid. This is like we're in Florida. Oh, I don't hike when it's this humid in Florida. We're stopping at about three miles for breakfast and to get more water. Well, that certainly looks inviting. about point one away from the shelter. Look how pretty green this is. We are going to town. Six days on the trail. Woo. It's been fantastic. That is just gorgeous. Partnership Shelter. Do they have enough notices up there? How you doing, Brooke? Okay. Coming up 
to the visitor center. And it is closed. as well as the bathroom. Hello. Hi. It's Thursday, July 8th, and we are in town. We have uh, been in the woods for the last six days and uh, have not had cell reception. Or battery. We've had some battery <laughs> issues. So you, you probably noticed that our videos on some days are, we're not doing a lot of talking because we very rarely had, you know, we had to conserve our power. And so we're in the town of Marion. We just had fantastic, fantastic trip mm -hmm. the last six days. And um, you I guys are going on to so the where? So Brooke's leaving us. Uh, she has to go back to work. We had to do a change of plan. She was supposed to leave. She's supposed to stay with us for uh, two more days. Two more nights, and unfortunately, she has to uh, get back. So she had to change her flight arrangements, and she won't be going back in the woods with us. And neither will Jason. Jason uh, is moving on as well. So it'll be Ken and I going on, and uh, we're going up to the Virginia Triple Crown. Which is very exciting. And I at least get to stay at the Woods Hole Hostel, which is amazing. And I'm sure she'll film there and we can, you know, upload that later. So what was your highlight of this last six week? So oh my goodness, six day stretch. So we went out, we were on the trail on a couple day stretch. Then we went back out for six days. What was your favorite this last six day stretch? I have two favorites. The first was there was this group of girls that were on some wilderness hike where they had no technology, like no watches, no phones, and they had to just rely on the trail. And because it was electronic lens, the lead for it, she made them do an activity every single day to help kickstart their mind and to enjoy nature. But we happened to be at a break site, uh, well, our break site, not necessarily a break site, when they came down to give the presentation because for that day, their thing was to create a sculpture and to give a presentation on the beauty of nature and to come up with the meaning of what that means to them. And that was pretty amazing. I really enjoyed watching that. And then my second favorite was our climb up to Thomas Knob Shelter. It was just so beautiful, <laughs> that climb. And my absolute favorite was the uh, Thomas, the, the climb up to Thomas Knob Shelter as well, which is the uh, Mount Rogers, mm -hmm. Mount Rogers uh, wilderness area. And unfortunately that day I woke up, we, we had stayed at Elk Garden the night before, which was a great place to camp. Uh, but I woke up that next day with an awful migraine. Actually the first time I've ever had a migraine on trail. Uh, so I did not want to hike. I did not want to hike. I sucked it up and hiked and it actually was my favorite day even though I had a migraine the whole time uh, but it was the forest was like Pacific Northwest it was just so green and lush and moist and fantastical yeah and the, and the views were great and then once we got uh, we got up to the top Thomas Knob shelter was up there and we, we took a break in the in Unfortunately, in the dense, densely uh, wooded areas, so that I could get out of the light, because the light was uh, activating my um, migraine, making it worse. And then we moved on and went into the Graceland Highlands, where in the same day, where we got to see the ponies and scramble over a bunch of rocks, which was fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so, in spite of that, uh, my migraine, I still thought that was the, the, my most favorite. And my second most favorite, I'd say, was at our very beginning of the trip first or second day, I can't remember where we were, it was in Tennessee, and um, just beautiful mountain views. I think it's because of the scenery and seeing the mountains. 
you know, for the first time in a couple of months was great. It's a good motivator too. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And uh, even though that was the hardest hiking, I think, you know, that was pretty hard hiking. We had some really steep up cli uh, long climbs, but uh, the reward was wonderful, definitely. And so we're in town. We got in here uh, maybe 2.30ish and um, went first thing. Uh, we got our room and threw our packs down and plugged in some electronics because we were desperate. And then we went and had Mexican food. We probably should not have gone to the restaurant. No regrets. And I'm not talking about the eating part of it. I'm talking about... I know. I have no regrets. It's okay to be a little stinky sometimes. We smelled really bad. We smelled really bad. And it was really bad. I I really thought they were going to put us in another section. <laughs> but they put us smack dab in the middle of people. So, um, I acted like I didn't smell. <laughs> and then after that, we went uh, up to Walmart to sc scout out the food situation because we're resupplying. Uh, Ken and I are resupplying. So uh, I had sent myself a box, a resupply box, kind of regretting it because I have a lot of stuff in here now that I have to carry it. And uh, we're, we only need a two-day resupply. But there's some things I like that I can't get on trail. And so I'm carrying it for like the rest of the trip. So my bag... I haven't even put the new stuff in it yet. This is just the stuff from the from the resupply box. It's already full. And I bought some stuff at Ingalls today. We bought some stuff. So I'm going to have to figure that one out. But we thought we'd just uh, talk because we haven't really been talking on the camera. It's like I said, we I, we wanted to get the scenery and, and and what, you know, what was going on uh, so that we could remember that. And then we thought we could talk here. We also thought we would have another section that we could film with each other, but mm -hmm. unfortunately that's not happening this trip. So maybe next time. So we will, um, uh, by now you, you will have seen all of our days. I don't even know what day we're on now. Uh, I haven't even uploaded any days yet, but it will, we will upload them. So bye for now. <laughs>